Hello and a warm welcome to a stadium that always oozes passion at St. James's Park. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, and my partner, ready to bring you all the analysis and technical talk, is Stuart Robson. I'm looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League coming right up. It's Newcastle United taking on Liverpool. Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. And here's the Newcastle formation. Nick Pope gets the nod between the posts. Miguel Almiron plays with Alan San Maxima in the wide areas. And the striker today is Alexander Isaac. Number 22, Nick Pope. Number five, Fabian Scar. Number 33, Dan Burn. Number 36, Sean Longstaff. Number seven, John Linton. Let's take a look at the Liverpool starting 11. Alisson begins in goal. Andrew Robertson starts with Trent Alexander-Arnold in the fullback positions. Jordan Henderson starts alongside Fabinho in the centre of midfield. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one player in attack. Thank you, St James's Park. Enjoy the game. And the game begins. Well, visionary passing, and he's in the clear. Well, there's a keeper on song. Well, how did he stop that? That's just unbelievable. Well, they fancy a short one. He thwarted the attack illegally. Now, perhaps a card is forthcoming. Well, there we have it. The first yellow card of the game. And he's going to have to be careful now. There's a long time to go here. Alexander Arnold and now Henderson and that's easy peasy for the keeper Anderson well Mo Salah knows how to light up any game I think it's fair to say Stuart well Derek he's the perfect finisher he's got a great shot on him his movement is excellent and in 1v1 situations you always expect him to score Oh, good use of the ball. Well, they were very patient, but they no longer have the ball. Sven Botman. Longstaff. And he's won the ball. Darwin Nunez. And return to Sala. Mo Salah, well, he loves to do this. Cut in off the flank. And well, that's how to do it inside your own penalty area. Anderson. Longstaff. Now can they make something happen? Chances on. There is the goal to open the scoring. Who can say they don't deserve to be in front? Yeah, here's the setup play. Well, it's a great little back heel, isn't it? And his movement's so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one thought in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal.
So the action continues and it's up to the Magpies to wipe out that last goal. Sam Maxima. It's with Joel Linton. Elliot Anderson. Longstaff. Joel Linton. And it wasn't taxing for the keeper. And that puts them in position. Salah. Gakpo. Well, he read that brilliantly at the back. Can they put it away? Well, threat averted. Almiron. And it's with Isaac. Well read to ease the pressure. Counter-attacking very much an option. Will it be sufficiently imaginative? Well, he's lost the ball. Joel Linton. And the Magpies moving the ball forward with purpose. Sam Maxima. Well, he would have been disappointed had he spilled that one. Henderson. Darwin Nunez. A super tackle and they've won possession. Longstaff. Isaac. Darwin Nunez. Salah. Almiron. Losing possession here. Clear foul play. And as a result, a free kick forthcoming. Well, he's certainly been warned, Stuart. No more challenges like that. Well, he's in no doubt now. He can't foul again. Well, no way to put a positive spin on that one. Disappointing. Well, I don't think he'll be on the next free kick, will he? That wasn't good at all. Salah. Well, it could be on for him here. Well, not every keeper would have been that brave. Well, he read it brilliantly, didn't he? Top stuff from the keeper. Sven Botman. Anderson. How far from the ideal pass, you've got to say. Can they create something? Sam Maxima. And it's with Isaac. Oh, what an opportunity. He can't hold on to it. And second time around, he scores. But the keeper left to wonder what his defenders were doing. Well, when you see this again, I think the goalkeeper's very unlucky. He makes a good initial save, but the ball comes off of him, rebounds straight to an attacker, and the finish is excellent.
Well, the first half story has been written half time here at St James's Park. I think most fans would be pretty happy with this man's display so far. Well, it was a vital goal and at a crucial time, you have to say. Certainly changes the complexion of the game now, but it's whether they can take the momentum into the second half as they've struggled at times today. Underway then in the second half. And the two teams matching each other just about stride for stride. Wonderful chance. Denied by the bar. Back in play here. Danger averted for now. A Liverpool free kick coming up. Well, they must exercise caution standing off as they are. Showing a lot of guile there. Opportunity! And quite simply, a wonderful chance was squandered. Robertson. Fabinho. And searching for his second, but the keeper equal to the task. Well, he's looking really lively, isn't he? Every time he gets the ball, he looks a threat. Now, how about the short corner? That deep delivery. He must struggle to get it away properly. And the referee has pointed to the spot. Penalty given. Missed to put them in front once more. In it goes! A well-taken penalty! Well, here it is again, and just watch the keeper. He stands still, hoping it's hit down the middle. Unfortunately for him, he's got it wrong. So back underway, intriguing contest this, given the 2-1 scoreline. Salah, Fabinho. There to win it back. Mo Salah. Longstaff. Almiron. Oh, a vital interception. Fabinho. A reminder, tickets for the next game are available for sale after today's game. Henderson has it. Showing patience as well as persistence in the build-up. Well, they were very patient, but they no longer have the ball. Nunez might be able to get in behind the defence can they put it away well good defending clattered out of there Alexander Arnold well, no danger now an awful lot of green space to run into Isaac
Just 20 minutes remaining now. Oh, great vision. Can he finish? Salah! And able to close down the shot. Oh, fine play, and maybe it'll set something up. He's in behind the defence here. Still alive. Henderson. Well, Liverpool have dominated possession in the last 15 minutes. They're creating some great opportunities. They just need to get that goal that kills the game off. Yes, it's so true. For once, they find themselves in defensive mode. Oh, maybe the equaliser. No shortage of excitement. Level again. No wonder they're excited. Yeah, here's the setup play. Well, it's a great little back heel, isn't it? And he makes no mistake with the finish. He showed a lot of composure there. And it's level again here. Both sets of fans being put through something of an emotional mangle. Henderson, Fabinho now, Liverpool trying to click into an attacking gear with the game level in the closing moments, safe pair of hands, did his job, Henderson, and an astute piece of defending, Joe Linton. Joe Linton. Strong play here. Will he play it in? Well, goal kick, just as it was looking promising. Both managers deciding this is the time to change things around. Both teams going to the bench. He gone and done. Isaac. And a goal! At this stage of the game, it might be decisive. And just look at their supporters. Well, here's the replay. And sometimes when you've been pressed high up the field, you have to go that little bit longer and not play out through the thirds. And that's what they tried to do here. They had their pocket picked and suddenly they find the ball in the back of the net. times for Liverpool can they pass this test they get forward but time is very much against them here well didn't go to plan in the end and the referee is going to add on four added minutes Milner, now Mo Salah, and showing fine vision. Well, the decision is offside, and he's bound to be a bit disappointed. Well, he's actually made his run before his teammate had control of the ball, and that's why it's offside. And that will be that, the final whistle here, and Newcastle fans around the world will be delighted with the outcome. What did you make of their performance? Yes, Derek, well, it could have gone either way, couldn't it? It was so competitive for much of the game, but they kept pushing, kept believing, and probably deserved the winner in the end. A great result. And in the final analysis, a really positive performance from this man, Stuart. Well, he's the match winner, and deservedly so. He was outstanding today. He's great to watch when he's in this sort of form.